part C of question 2, it says a formula is given as D equal 4H square root of 4H divided by 5. So you must determine the value of D when H is 29. Give your answer correct to three significant figures. Alright? So, we have D. Equal the square root of 4H over 5. Remember, 4H, it really means 4 multiplied by H. But <coughs> you usually leave out the multiplication sign between the number and the letter. Alright? So D is equal to square root of 4 times, 4 times what? It's H, but they say H is 29. So, you have 4 times 29. Make sure the square root sign covers all of it. Divided by 5. Alright? So, D equals. You have 4 by 29. And that comes out to 116. So, you have a square root of 116 over 5. So, on further calculation, 116 over 5, what do you get? 23.2, alright? So, you have the square root of 23.2. Now, you say D equals, what's the square root of 23.2? 4.8166 Alright, good number of the small places there And significant figures But guess what? They said two, three significant figures So, considering that What is D really? Remember You see the first significant figure When you look from left to right And see the first non-zero digit the first digit that is not zero <coughs> it's four you have four point four is the first significant figure the second significant figure here is eight and the third significant figure is one now if you write one you would be you wouldn't really have complete correct answer here what happened is that when you look at one you must also look at the number to the right of one if that number is five or more then you add one to the one and round up to two six is five or more so you're going to go back to the one and add one to it and let it be two so d is 4.82 to 3 significant figure. Right.